Wonder Woman has encompassed all these amazing qualities, but what stood out the most for you? What do you like the most about her? Uh, that she's uh, fun. She's so positive and so warm and loving. Um, could you ever have imagined that one day you would play this iconic role on the screen? Never in my life, no. I never planned on being an actress, so for me everything kind of, you know, one thing led to the other, the other led to a different thing. And honestly, I'm, s I'm so lucky and grateful that I'm the one to portray this character who's so iconic and so great and stands for so many beautiful things. Uh, but no, I never thought that I will get to play Wonder Woman in my wildest dreams. What did you do to prepare a role like this, both physically and research-wise? Ooh, la la. So, physically, uh, the we did a lot of work. You can't fake, you know, looking strong, and you can't fake looking powerful. You can you just can't. So you have to be that. And I had to train for five, six months prior to the shoots. And I did uh, a lot of fight choreographies with the sword, with everything, with the sword, with kicks, with jumping, with you name it, we did that. A lot of gym work so I can ga gain some body mass. And horseback riding, which I always thought that it was like, when people say, yeah, we do sports, we, we ride on horses, I thought to myself, this is so silly because the horse does all the, all the work. No. Horseback riding is a very, very exhausting sport. Um, so that too. And as far as uh, getting ready for the for the character, um, you know, I've been I've already established a character when I was shooting Batman vs Superman with Zack Snyder, and on this movie I had the privilege to go all the way back to the beginning, and 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 establish the history of this character and with Patty Jenkins and Jeff Jones and the writers and myself we always thought okay how are we going to tell her story in a way that men going to be able to relate to her and women's going to be able to relate to her and and we found that she should have qualities of human with strength of a goddess and uh, and you know heart of a human strength of a goddess and and a very very wise brains um and we did that leads to some really funny you, you mentioned uh, that, that it was fun to do the funny moments with chris's character when you know you've got your innocence but at the same time um, you're strong as you said you know and he's kind of a man of this world and he's in the middle of this war and there's a there's a fun banter there between yeah. the two of you right yeah what I, what I like about first of all it was a pleasure working with with Chris he's hilarious he's funny I truly enjoyed working with him and it w we we kept on laughing all the time um, but I think that Diana and Steve's relationship is very interesting because it's not about who's driving the relationship and it's not about power dynamic and who's in charge who's more in charge it was very much equal but because both of them are coming from different worlds then they have these clashes of communication that they just don't get each other and it's funny um, and that was a lot of fun to shoot